Okay, Aquarius, this is going to be your message. You have the Queen of Swords, Justice, King of Swords, Lovers, Hermit, Page of Cups. All right, so this is such an interesting reading because it's all air energy right here. You have, I think whoever, if you are dealing with someone, if you are, you know, right now you're thinking about a situation I think it, it, it involves somebody that has air placements like yourself. So you two kind of trade in or you kind of connect over this kind of airy energy communication and thoughts. What it kind of signals to me is that there's things that you have been thinking about and there's things that another person has been thinking about that communication wants to happen and actually with this justice right in the middle it talks about that being fair the fair thing to do maybe there's an unevenness maybe there's been a lack of forthrightness and in order to balance it there's some things that need to be said all right so let's add the clarifiers there is an ace of pentacles here though this kind of looks really good actually um, there's an ace of pentacles and a queen of cups. I do think that this situation, it, it looks worse. It's like one of those things where it looks worse than it actually is. It can feel like it might be more, it might be more triggering. You might have more defense to it than actually is needed. Because it feels like this will have a, an outcome, which is actually really good. Alright, so let's look at your cards. Queen of Swords here. This is somebody that wants to say something. They've got something on their chest. This is, I would associate this with more like um, Libra. But, you know, it's just somebody that maybe this person has been observing things. They need to set records straight. They need to say something which is going, which is important to be said. I think you can always rely on the Queen of Swords to speak truths when they need to be spoken. And that's what's happening here. You have Gemini energy again. Um, more air energy. But it's like, with this, it kind of feels like there's two people. This can be a connection or a partnership. But it can also be a choice to be made to see what's on your mind. This can be you. This can be somebody else. There's some things that need to be said. But because the lovers is here, I don't think it's in ill will. I don't think it's that you don't like this person. Or it's like you want this person to go away. It's like because it's one of those things where it's like because I love you, I have to say these things. Yeah. Yeah. All right, Hermit and Justice. Okay, Libra energy, but also you have Virgo as well. So maybe you have been thinking a lot about you are this person. Could be thinking a lot about what's the right thing to do? What is the fair thing between us? Um, and that is, that's a lot, you know, but that's good because to think, to consider what the fair and right thing is is actually really above board um it's it feels like right now it just needs to be communicated it almost feels like a, a big discussion two people that need to have to get on the page of okay there's some big choices facing us we have a strong um bond we have a strong connection there's some decisions that we can make to move into one way or another way and let's it's not like we're thinking together it kind of feels like you've thought about this maybe they've thought about this they reflected on this and kind of feels like it's time to put some things right um that happens you know at times and it doesn't mean anything it just means that actually it's actually a good sign for friendships relationships that they're growing when you can have this type of conversation with people all right so your change is for better king of swords page of cups 
it kind of feels like um and this is aquarian energy right this is squarely aquarian energy is to be able to hear with discernment the feelings of somebody it kind of feels like this person is going to be saying things from an emotional place even though it's the queen of swords maybe that's why it's the page of cups there's going to be some kind of feeling emotion that's brought up this person has also feeling and it's, it's in other words it's not kind of a cold even though you two might be kind of intellectually and communicatively suited don't disregard that there's also emotions running beneath that this person could be um have watery placements or you could as well um but it's just i think the reminder here is like whatever discussion you do you guess you can use the intellect you can use the the mind to figure things out to to make decisions but don't let that be the only part that you consider also act in a space of sensitivity intuitiveness kindness love it's like a balance right because the king of swords is almost the opposite feeling to the page of cups if you can activate all those areas the wisdom the wit the communication but also be open sensitive and emotionally expressive is the other thing i would say um those two things offset each other in a good way and i do think that this other person who shows up as queen of swords might be it might be the thing that actually is just the thing you know um what i'm seeing in hidden energy is ace of pentacles queen of cups six of wands okay so what this shows me is that if you can get on this page there is um, a sense that you can have the success that you want i don't think you want nothing to do with this person i think it's like let's renegotiate this situation i do think you're you 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 would be able to create a situation an opportunity where there is more connection actually there is more feeling there's more awareness of each other's feelings and what do we have after that the empress so it's trying again with the nine of wands here the empress you know it's success with the empress if you can take a soft so it's like soft but wise approach to whatever is coming up here and i kind of feel like it's maybe recontextualizing a relationship yeah how you've been approaching it nine of wands is trying again trying again you've tried several times and it can feel like you're weary but and maybe you give up but change can happen right change can happen and that's really the point of me doing these readings you know i want change for you in your relationships so all the best aquarius this is what i have for you i was gonna say libra a while ago but this is what i have for you i think it's a good reading i think it's like a little bit of hard work to get to a whole lot of good so all the best do like comment and subscribe if you like this and i'd love to have you on another reading take care